Hey guys, this is Mr. Pogsamar and today I'm gonna teach you how to make the Honeycomb or the Dalgona game from the Squid Game series in Minecraft Pocket Edition or Better Edition. So let's get started. So as you can see, we have here the four shapes. We have the triangle, the circle, the star, and the umbrella. So all we have to do is to choose one and let's choose this one, the triangle. And this is what will happen as you can see. We're going to cut out the triangle right here which is this yellow triangle right here I'm stepping on. So meaning we're going to take away all of this orange carpets uh, right here. So let's do it. Let's uh, try this one. So as you can see if you're going to uh, do it perfectly just like this make sure not to cut off uh, the yellow carpets right here so if you can do it correctly as you can see nothing will happen and if we're going to cut this one as you can see you have there the congratulations it means you won the game but let's say uh, we're going to cut this one let's see what will happen if you're going to cut it as you can see if you cut it wrong then you will die just like in the squid game and that is so awesome so first all we have to do is to place here uh, four blocks of iron just like that and then we're going to add button right here just like that and then uh, we're going to uh, add another uh, block of iron at each and then we're going to use item frame right here so we're going to represent the uh, four shapes right here so this one is going to be the triangle of course this one is the circle nether star for the star of course and for the umbrella it's gonna be the peak X so you just need to rotate it just like that so that it will look like an umbrella and then uh, what we're going to do right here is to dig this just like that and then uh, we will go all the way uh, here uh, it, it must be here so we're going to stack up uh, blocks of iron so until we reach Y level uh, 18 so this one is gonna be the safe uh, height just like that and then uh, from here we're going to make a circle so it's gonna be like this this one for the first corner or first side uh, it has side although it's a circle because we are in Minecraft so it's gonna be like this so just copy everything right here uh, we need to add uh, three more going that way so that's gonna be the pattern right here uh, two more it must be like this and then uh, lastly here there we go so that's going to be the circle and then at the middle we're going to put a triangle this time it's gonna be made of a block of gold so it must be like this uh, change that one to block of gold and then put uh, another side right here of the triangle there we go and for the base of the triangle we will just put a long uh, line of uh, blocks of gold just like that and then just put more uh, blocks of gold to complete the triangle just like that and also to complete uh, the white blocks of iron we just need to put more there we go so we have now our first uh, shape it's going to be the triangle now what we're going to do next is to get uh, the block of diamond right here put the blocks of diamonds on top of uh, the blocks of gold just like that so you, you're going to cover them and then break all the blocks of gold right here below just like that there we go and then next what we're going to do is to put some absorber blocks right here just like that so they, they must be uh, facing up and the red circle at the middle must be facing down just like that there we go and then we're going to put here some blocks of iron going down and then we're going to replicate the triangle right here so it must be like this just like that there we go so the triangle must be like that so we can now actually remove everything right here there we go Next, we're going to put uh, some redstone dust uh, to the triangle on top of the triangle, just like that. There we go. So make sure 
uh, every top of the blocks of iron will be covered with uh, redstone dust. There we go. Next, we're going to remove every uh, diamond block right here. So all of this will be removed just like that. And then we're going to replace them with a uh, yellow carpet. There we go. So every uh, absorber block. There we go. So as you can see, uh, what will happen is that if you're going to remove this uh, yellow carpet, as you can see, it will activate uh, all the redstone right here. And that is so awesome. We're going to need that concept right there. Next, we're going to uh, cover every blocks of iron right here with uh, diamond blocks. So just cover everything right here, just like that. And then this time, we're going to remove all of the iron block uh, from underneath, just like this. So you just need to be uh, very careful. There we go. Also here. There we go. So next, we're going to put absorber blocks right here. So uh, we're going to put actually three at each. There we go. So it must be like this. Make sure the arrows, all of the arrows are facing down just like that. If not, it's not going to work. So let's continue doing this. There we go. So we're done. Now we're, we're going to remove right now all the diamond blocks right here on top and then replace them with orange carpet this time. There we go, that is so awesome. So we're going to do that here on the other side as well. And then orange carpet, there we go. So as you can see the faces, they must be covered with carpets, all of them. And then right here below, we're going to uh, put uh, some pistons facing down as well. So they must be attached to the three uh, lines of absorber blocks there we go so it must be like this you need to be careful uh, so that uh, the pistons must be facing down there we go next we're going to put uh, two more blocks of iron going down uh, just like this and then we're going to replicate the shape just like this it's it must be like this and then we're going to do the same thing right here uh, remove that and then replicate just replicate the shape so it must be like this be careful uh, you need to replicate the shape completely it must be correct just like that there we go and then next uh, we're going to put some uh, redstone torch right here on top of the blocks of iron each blocks of iron uh, right here there we go and then uh, finally here as well there we go and then this time we're going to use a block of gold we're going to cover uh, the inside with blocks of gold all of uh, the spaces here inside as well as the outside uh, right here so let's do it like this so you're going to do it like this exactly like this there we go so we're going to uh, make a, a border line actually to cover the uh, blocks of iron just like that so it must be like this and then this time we're going to put some redstone dust here inside just like that so we're going to connect all of the resin torches right here just place a uh, redstone dust on top of the blocks of gold just like this there we go so just copy everything right here there we go make sure you cover each uh, block of gold with a uh, redstone dust just like that there we go next we're going to put here redstone torch and then uh, we will need the command block so for us to get it let's type here slash e bad p command underscore block just like that it must be here and then what we're going to do is to put the command block uh, right here it must be uh, right there and then or it can be down here as well it doesn't matter so what we're going to type right here is a uh, kill now it's not kill at e it must be a title uh, it must be title at a and then title once again and then you're going to put here congratulations meaning you won the game to make sure the spelling is correct it must be congratulations just like that and then right here we're going to put another uh, torch right here somewhere here 
and then we're going to put another command block and then this time uh, we're going to put here a kill at a and then it must be a bracket r equals 10 just like that so basically we are done and then what we're going to do is to go back all the way right here we're going to place the command block right here but first we need to get the coordinates uh, here so you must be here so as you can see my coordinates will be negative uh, 134 21 and then 60 take note of your coordinates now let's go back all the way right here and then put a command on the command block it must be a tp at p and then the coordinates negative 134 uh, 21 and then 60 just like that and then that's it so we just need to cover uh, this hole with grass block right here there we go so we are ready we're gonna clear our inventory and then we can go to game mode s as well thank you so much for watching Are you listening? Damn.